Good evening. It is 6.30, we're still home. We're not leaving just yet. And we think that I might be sick. Do I sound sick? I sound okay. congested, I feel congested. We think I have a sinus infection, or I do. I didn't sleep much at all last night because I was so congested. And I've had like a, a real bad sinus headache. Or we the just past, are like, two hours. withdrawal from the air hearts. Or yeah, or we have withdrawal from the air hearts. I have a headache, I'm like sleepy. Katie's actually gonna come see our apartment for the first time ever. And then I think we might go watch Monsters, Inc. at uh, Polynesian. Because that's the movie under the stars. Yeah, we just want to relax. And I kind of want to, hoping one of the benches or hammocks are out. I just want to get my toes in the sand, you know. After many, many moons, Katie finally makes it to our apartment. She's been outside it. Why are you biting me? Why are you biting me? You have to make me feel the love. Oh my gosh. What are you doing? Do you see who's here? Do you see who's here? She's like, it's party time. Oh my god. Eve. And Katie brought Sarah Pop Tarts. Because I, <laughs> I the, smoked my gravy. The best kind of Pop Tarts. It's when you, because when you put it out into the universe, sometimes it comes to fruition. <laughs> Wait a minute. I love they that met. Song. I heard that song. <laughs> they met. They met. Like, Our lives are crossing officially. Our, I think Dustin thinks I'm at work. Uh, Does he? he you should tell him. Though. No. He won't. Let's be honest. I moved in. Yesterday was four years ago. Yesterday? Yesterday. Yeah. And it was seven years ago today for us? Or no, next week? Two, I need second. They're lying on their Facebook page! Brickhardproject.com We left the house. Guess where we are. The Polynesian, I'm guessing. You're right. I drove here, so I should know. <laughs> They're playing uh, Monsters Incorporated, but there's They're lightning. supposed to be. So, so. There's a lot of lightning, so we don't know if it's going to be moved inside or canceled. So, if anything, we'll watch some fireworks from the beach or something. Do we like say I don't that. feel good? Yes, Peter does not feel good. I have a sore throat. Peter's like full on yuck. Yeah, yuck, congestion, sinus infection, all kinds of nonsense. Got like yeah. I, th I think I probably got three hours of sleep. We're in a need of a day where we just sleep all day. No, we're just in a day of like today. Yeah, we're gonna relax. But this is our usual. This is our usual shenanigans. We go to lots of resorts. We do a lot of chillin'. We only go to the parks for like three hours every day, or property every day. Um, so, so we're just back to normal now that like people were on vacation, so they wanted to be in the parks. I have a feeling this weekend Sarah's gonna end up staying home one day, and I'm gonna go explore the world. Right, so we were nervous about the lightning, but apparently they're not as concerned about that. They, have to... they are about the fireworks. That's yeah, so the fireworks are actually 8.55, and they're gonna, I think they're gonna push back the movie until after, which is awesome. But I guess they're gonna play Nintendo Switch games, which is, I've never seen that before, until the fireworks, or until after the fireworks. So like if you didn't, if you wanna get a good spot for the movie, they're like, hey, come, come play Switch until then. So we're not going to play that, we're going to go see if we can enjoy some happily ever after before Monsters Inc. going straight towards the movie. Oh, they're all just leaving. I hope they're leaving. But this is, I'm glad, I was, it was kind of nice of the rec, rec department to wait until after the fireworks to let all the families who wanted to enjoy the fireworks and then come to the movie. All right, I need everyone's help. Let's count down from 10. 10, 9, 8, 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, that was super cool. Good job. Let's give it up for me. Good job, Mason. Enjoy the movie, guys. Yes. Best intro sequence of any Pixar ever. Do you agree, disagree, or are you uncertain? I agree. We got that popcorn, popcorn, white cheddar popcorn. For family. Scariest movie. I wish, I kind of feel Monsters University, but. We can watch it when we get home. Yeah. Let's just not go to bed tonight. I need scarers like, like James P. Sullivan. relaxing night. I think I needed it with all the congestion and everything going on. But I wanted to tell you guys about something cool that I've been trying out for the past like month or so with the whole eating better, dieting and running thing. Um, we don't do many of these things but we actually got reached out to by a company called Teamy and they offered us like a little trial and then just asked to do a little review and so we did. Well I did. Um, Sarah thought, we thought about Sarah doing it but then we decided because we don't go into too much. We've talked about how like I don't eat olive oil too much even though it's delicious. Same with spinach because that kind of stuff messes with my stomach. Um, so I've got a weird stomach. But the reason why I decided to say yes to teamy tea blends is because they kind of like, they kept, the pitch was on like a healthier feeling stomach. And that's what like was the biggest intrigue to me. And then I did research and saw that like people, some people did have good effects, some people didn't. It had no effects at all. So I was like, you know what? Sure, we'll give it a try. We'll give it a review. So we got the box from Teamy. Super cool kit they sent us, and it came with a 30 day supply of their Teamy Skinny and then their Teamy Colon. And a water bottle with a nice cool filter, which is super convenient to actually brew the tea in. And this cool little sleeper. Look how cute that is. So I got, we got that, and uh, I went on the, the little 30-day, I don't want to call it a challenge, but 30 days of, uh, of trying it out. And I will say, so the detox tea is a loose-leaf tea, so you actually have to brew that, like steep it in the water. That's what the, this cute thing is for. Um, you have that every day. So I had that every morning, and they advertise it as like a, it starts your metabolism and all that good stuff. It's like an oolong tea for any actual tea fans out there. It's like an oolong with a little bit of a citrusy flavor to it. I like the flavor a lot. Um, what I got out of it, I felt like it didn't kickstart my metabolism, is it did wake me up and it did, um, I did find myself needing less coffee. You guys know I drink a lot of coffee and I was having less of that during the day. So I really enjoyed that. And it did make me, it did make my stomach feel better because I kind of have like a weird stomach. I'm always, um, in some kind of like battling some kind of like stomach issue or pain but it helped it didn't get rid of it but it did help and then the other one the teamy colon is actually you do that every other night um, that's got a bold taste I'll just put it that way um, it doesn't have a citrusy or a fruit taste to it uh, it is a bolder taste not the most enjoyable but that's supposed to help like clean clean your stomach and everything and it did I mean it was good um, I found the Timmy Colon to be a good use. I guess I guess that's the detox aspect of it. But the the Timmy Skinny was what I thought would, was awesome. Um, I enjoyed the the like the 30 days of having that. And I don't know if it was as much as what was in it, or if it was just the consistency of having that good tea. Organic people always talk about the benefits of tea in different ways. So to consistently be putting that in me was probably beneficial. But um, 
definitely a cool option if you're looking for a detox. I know detoxes can be expensive. I've looked at them before just because this has been uh, my stomach weirdness has been going on for years and years, but detoxes are real expensive. So this one isn't as intense as many of the other ones out there, but they're a great product. The team at Team has been super helpful about like asking me questions about my diet and wondering like, is the tea gonna be good for you? Like, should we look at it beyond the tea? Are you eating not the right things? Are you eating or like enough vegetables and stuff? So they were super helpful, but um, they actually gave us a coupon code. So if you guys are interested, check it out. If you have any questions more detailed about my experience doing it, um, shoot us a comment or an, an email or a Facebook page, but you can do Brookhart 15 on Timmy's website. We'll put all the links down below. Uh, you get 15% off your purchase. Um, there's a bunch of different packages you can do. You can buy 30 day packs or just individual things, just the mugs or cups, just little steepers. Look at that, I can't get over it. I love having this thing like on my work desk um, throughout the day, but check it out if you're if you're looking for it. Um, I definitely suggest the, the, the Timmy Skinny just to like, to kind of get you better feeling overall. And like I said, it was more of like an energy boost, I feel more than like, a dietary thing. I, don't, I think that it's a mixture of all of it why they call it Teamy Skinny, but I looked at it, it felt like more of like a refreshing way to start my day, to kick start it. You, then again, you guys know how tired of a person I am and my sleeping schedule. So just a thought, uh, give it a roll or put the information down below and we're up for questions too. And thank you again, Teamy. I really enjoyed it and uh, I'll at least be stocking up more on that Teamy Skinny. So, I'm excited for tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go do trivia, Port Orleans. Eve's going to the bed. Mm -hmm. We're going to a doctor's appointment. Yes. So, all positive leaning things. Obviously, we don't want to bring Eve to the bed, but yeah. she's been having this weird itch and dry skin thing going on, so yeah. we're gonna get that checked out. You'll see Katie tomorrow. Yeah. So, Hopefully get ready Dustin. for that. Hopefully, Dustin. Sometimes he's a, he's a little snot sometimes. He's your friend. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>